you know of the Prime Directive, which tells us that we have no right to interfere in the natural evolution of alien worlds. Now, I have sworn to uphold it. But nevertheless, I have disregarded that directive on more than one occasion. I'm Captain Jean-Luc Picard of the Federation Starship Enterprise. T. Earl Grey, hot. Engage. Make it so. I'm here to relieve you of command of the Enterprise. How many ships? One. And it's on a direct course for Earth. At maximum warp, it will take us three hours, 25 minutes. We're not going. Our orders are to patrol the neutral zone. They believe that a man who was once captured and assimilated by the Borg should not be put in a situation where he would face them again. He wanted me to warn him if the crew started to lose confidence in him. Now, if you can't find it within yourself to stand up and tell the truth about what happened, you don't deserve to wear that uniform. Your involvement in this affair is going to be thoroughly investigated, Will. There will be some hard questions for you to answer. I understand. Your Starfleet. He won't kill me. You sure? What is our mission? I'm under no obligation to tell you that. I have a lot of friends at Starfleet Command, Captain. You're going to need them. What's the captain up to? That's not the captain I know. Phoenix and the Enterprise will return to Federation space together. The only alternative is to put you in the brig, to tow your ship back to the Starbase in disgrace. You learn to watch your back when you're around those people. Villains who twirl their moustaches are easy to spot. Those who clothe themselves in good deeds are well camouflaged. Nobody has suggested removing the captain from command. The next move is his. Let's make sure history never forgets the name Enterprise. Welcome to the 24th century.